This is now a federal terrorism investigation led by the FBI. The FBI officially takes over the investigation into the massacre in San Bernardino today, officially describing that shooting as a terroristic act. Well, today's announcement came after investigators discovered that the female suspect vowed allegiance to ISIS on Facebook and after discovering a bomb-making lab in the suspect couple's home. The big question tonight, what does that mean for us? Ian Smith is in studio this evening after speaking to a local expert on Homeland Security. Luke, Dr. Danny Davis is with A&M's Bush School of Government and Public Service, and he's an expert when it comes to homeland security. When the FBI began investigating the shooting in California as an act of terrorism, Davis wasn't the least bit surprised. He says the couple may have been self-radicalized, meaning they didn't act under the orders of the terrorist group, such as ISIS, but instead through their own initiative. Davis says, however, they, the couple seems to have carried out a radical attack in the name of Islam, and he says this changes the game when it comes to security here at home, and everybody, everyday citizens need to be vigilant. From a personal standpoint, personal protection, I think Americans really need to start thinking seriously about self-protection. You know, if you're in a restaurant, if you're at a ball game, wherever you are, you need to have in the back of your mind, I mean, you know, if something happens, I gotta, I gotta protect myself. Davis also says we could see economic impacts due to acts of domestic terrorism. These impacts could include increased public and private security, which could cost more